Hello and welcome to the Mykonos vlog. My European summer has started and it is literally the middle of September, but that's okay because the sun is shining. It's like 27 degrees outside. I am so excited. This is my belated birthday trip from Tommy, who is currently eating Pringles over there. He knows. Oh my gosh, I'll tell you what, the crisps and stuff when you're abroad are so much better than at home. Like we bought so much yesterday. We've just been snacking on them, but I'll give you a little room tour. It's not the tidiest at the moment because there's not a huge amount of storage, but we're staying at the Andronikos Mykonos Hotel, which is not too far from the old town. We walked to the old town yesterday because this is our like first full day, but we did like a half day yesterday and it's a good location. So let me give you a tour. Okay, so front door here, you've got just the toilet in here, not the shower or anything, literally just the toilet wardrobe sneak peek at the outfits oh tommy's ones can move out the way for a second we're going for a pink and neutral vibe the couple of like black things thrown in and then this dress too very excited to wear all of these bits and i've got my shoes down there then you come into the main bulk of the room you've got the bed here which is very low down but it's not too bad like did you sleep okay last night yeah it's really comfy yeah, it is really, really comfy. And then you've got the rest of the room here. Showers here, little sink area, and then the rest of the room. And let me show you the balcony. My camera is flashing red with the battery already. That's not good. Um, but this is what the outside looks like. We've got a, got a bloody hot tub. Look at that. Amazing. And then this is the view from outside our room. Amazing! I'm so excited for this vlog. I really hope you enjoy it. We've just had some time tanning by the pool, but in true Tommy and I's fashion, we just get bored really easily. I don't know if anyone else is like this, but we're just not really like lounging around in the sun, people. I wish I was, but I think we're... I don't, I don't know where I grew up and we went out and did things more. I don't, I don't know, but that's just the way I am. Anyway, we are heading off to Mykonos Town. Don't watch the snacks. Um, so I thought I'd show you what I'm wearing. I think both of the... Pe Actually, everything I'm wearing is naked fashion. Top's naked fashion, skirt is, and my little belly chain. But I thought this was quite a nice vibe for the town and again hair just slicked up every single day it's going to be slicked up although actually the wind is better today than it was yesterday yesterday's wind was just another level so it's a little bit more calm but yeah this is the fit what's tommy wearing tommy has got oh it's very dark hang on couture club shirt adidas shorts new Can't balance trainers new no they are very nice Lovely, stylish boyfriend. Just switched over to my phone as we're in the town, um, but we've come to Jimmy's Giros, which was recommended on TikTok. This is what it's like inside. Apparently they do the best Giros on the island. It's really cheap, like six euros for Mykonos is an absolute steal. Also, we went to Starbucks, got myself a little matcha. Very, very good. Got it for the journey, because it's a bit of a walk into town. Um, not a bit of a walk, but just down a hill. So I was like, oh, I'll get myself a little sweet treat for the journey. Tell me you're the fussiest person in the world without telling me. I, I'm actually, I was embarrassed ordering this. Don't really like to see you. So yeah, this is what Tommy's looks like. This is how it's meant to look. It looks really good. How absolutely gorgeous is Mykonos Town? It's quite quiet at the moment. I feel like three o'clock is a good time to come if you just want to like not have to deal with the crowds, but yeah, it's amazing. The Jimmy's place is just up there. I can't really tell you where any streets are because I literally have absolutely no idea, but it's kind of like slap bang in the middle. But yeah, so nice. So many like different shops as well. And then these gorgeous pink flowers. I love how I said it's not busy and I feel like it's just gotten really busy, but looking up is just the most amazing thing to do because it's all so stunning. Like, look at that. Oh, I absolutely love it here. I think last time I came here, I wasn't doing YouTube. I can't remember if I was. Oh, stop, another cat. Oh my gosh, there's so many gorgeous cats here. How cute. Oh, and look at this little baby here. How cute. Oh. Oh my gosh, yeah, they do. You know what, the cats have definitely looked after well here from what I can see. Little pictures. Oh, that one's got a little bug on its face. But yeah, so lovely. Oh, so snoozy. And then you've got this one here, the little black and white one. Adorable. 
Okay, the wind is winding, but we've come to Little Venice for a cocktail. This is our view looking out. A cruise ship. Tommy's gone for an Aperol Spritz. Shock. It's his favorite drink. And then I have gone for a passion fruit one. I really hope you can hear this, but yeah. Okay, so update, we are now ready for dinner. I've actually done like a full face of makeup, which I probably will regret. I mean, I say full face. I did like a tinted moisturizer, concealer, basically a full face apart from like a high coverage foundation, but the vibes, the vibes are vibing. I um, also put on the Refi, oh, where is it? The Refi Topaz glow which when I was putting on because I put it on in here I was like mm, it doesn't look that great but just watch when I go outside because the, the glow be glowing can you see that hopefully you can it's really bright but the glow's glowing I'm gonna go back inside I can't I can't see a thing so I'm wearing this little house of CB dress I actually wore this a while ago um, for one of Tommy's like friends wedding things but I thought I'd bring it again because I feel like it screams holiday. It's such a vibe. I don't know how I'm gonna walk to town in this because I can't really move my legs that far in it. But yeah, I wanna show you a full length shot. I wonder if I can put you here. Oh, okay, yes, that's gonna work. This is what we're looking at. Such a vibe, gorgeous dress. I will link it down below. And then my mum actually got me this bag for my birthday, um, it's from LK Bennett, and I thought that it actually matched the vibes perfectly. It's really nice, I feel like LK Bennett is, it was probably more of like a brand that my mum wears, but they have some good stuff. So when she pulled this out, I was like, come through mum. Love it, I'm so excited. Oh my gosh, I tell you what, we have lucked out with where we're sat for dinner. This is insane. My hack would be, if you want to get a table like this at Veranda Bar, book ahead. Because as soon as I said we had a booking, she took us straight off to this like other section so other people like sit around there. But this is unbelievable. You can see the windmills, the sunset. Oh my gosh, this is heaven. Got myself a little strawberry margarita. Tommy's gone for an Aperol Spritz. And now we're just waiting. I think the sunset's in like, 10, 20 minutes, but my goodness, this is something else. Update, we have got ourselves a pizza. This looks amazing. I feel like the pizza that we got yesterday, I know I didn't show it, but that was like 10 out of 10, but this looks gorgeous. Got ourselves some drinks. Tommy's now got another, no, you haven't got another apple. You've got a- Watermelon sangria. Watermelon sangria. I've gone for the same. Sunset update, still beautiful. Just got back to the room and there's some live music downstairs. Oh, I don't know where she is. Oh, there she is. Let me zoom in. I like her sparkly outfit. Come on, girl. Yes, she's very good. Oh, she's remixing herself. Good morning. It is full day number two in Mykonos and we are in our beach club gear. The beach club gear, that's literally the most uncool thing I've ever said. But we are heading to Kalua Beach Club today, which we are so excited for. It was a last minute switch because we were going to go to Branco, but it seems like it's more of a chilled vibe than like a party vibe. And we're both, what a party vibe today, aren't we babes? Mm -hmm. A little bit of a party vibe. I feel like we're gonna regret saying that later, but um, I want to show you the outfit. Where did I put my camera yesterday to show you? Was it here? I think it was. Yes, here we go. This is the fit. It is all from Revolve, from a brand called Love Wave. I actually think they've just put this on sale because it wasn't on sale when I bought it. Um, but yeah, I think it's really cute. And then this is the back. But I think I'm gonna pop a little top on over the top because I do feel a little bit exposed in this um, and then the bag that I'm bringing is this one here and then Tommy is bringing like a big um, tote bag god I nearly forgot the word then thank you so yeah that's the plan we're gonna grab a cab cabs are apparently really hard to get here because there's literally like 30 something on the island so we're gonna try our best if not we have the option of a bus so we might be doing that 
but I'll keep you posted. We've just arrived at Kalua and I don't think I've seen somewhere so beautiful. It is just the aesthetic of everything is out of this world. And then you've got the beach there. We're just waiting for our sunbed now. So exciting. And this is our camp for the day. Third row up so close to the beach. We thought we would be smart and get food and water before anything else. So I've gone for some avocado maki. Tommy's gone for the club sandwich, which is huge. And it comes with fries. We probably didn't need to get the extra fries. The sandwich was cheese though. Yeah, club sandwich. Do you not want the cheese? You can just take the cheese. Tommy doesn't like um, cheese unless it's melted. Interesting. Um, so yeah, this is, this is what we've got and it's very hot i'm so glad i bought this with me like this is a godsend an absolute godsend we're getting tommy on the rose uh we've gone for the petal de rose which is actually i think kalua have got like a collaboration with it but tommy's not usually a wine person what are you thinking you like it amazing in case he doesn't we got him like a little sprite so he can make himself a spritz oh my god We are back at the hotel now. I hope the lighting's okay. I feel like the sun is going down, but we've come back from Kalua. One thing I would say is obviously Kalua is a beautiful place to be. Like I would recommend going to at least one beach club if you're coming to Mykonos, but the prices of the taxi, we live, we live. The hotel is, uh, I think it's 12 minutes away, 12, 13 minutes. And we just paid 40 euros to come back, which was, insane like i feel like that is unbelievable but you know what we had a good time i think what tommy and i are going to do now is we're going to head down to the town we're just going to have a really simple evening i think we're just going to grab ourselves like a little pizza or some drinks watch the sunset and then just chill and then tomorrow we to be honest we we did think about going to another beach club tomorrow but after today i just don't think we will because it was a madness i think realistically I think we spent about about 200, 270 euros, what was, what was that, like 240 pounds, so you know, it's one of those things that you've got to, in Mykonos, it's a special place, you've got to do what you've got to do, but yeah, I think that means because we did that and it was such a treat, like during lunch, during the, the majority of the daytime, we're going to do something like really chill this evening. We might go back to Sinner's Pizza, which is the place we went to on the first night. I don't think I filmed that because I popped it on my Instagram story. But we might head back there because the pizza was so good. They did like chicken paprika pizza. And I just keep thinking about it. It was unbelievable. So, yeah, I think we might head there. But, um, yeah, we're just going to enjoy the sunset. Enjoy just a beautiful evening. This is what I'm wearing. Just like super like casual vibes. But... Sometimes, you know what, I'm more comfortable in this than I was in my little bikini outfit earlier. Like, this is so lovely. I'll try and link it if I can. I think it's, um, I think it's Princess Polly from like three years ago. So I'll see if I can find something similar and then I'll pop it below. We are here at Sinner's Pizza. Tommy's gone for a pizza. I actually oh went my for. God, cat's like the cat. Oh my God, no, it is. Wait, you see it in the distance. Oh. Darling, so cute. Anyway, got myself. That's not a bad, isn't it? Anyway, um, got myself a like stir fry chicken thing, and we're gonna have some on the pot. We missed the sunset, but we did watch the sunset as we were walking down. But this is where Sinner's Pizza is. It's down like a lovely little street. It's quite quiet. I feel like it's one of those places that's maybe a little bit busier in the evening, but. 100% recommend that like, it's 17 euro for a pizza which to be honest for Mykonos is a very decent price I tell you what this is how you end a very busy beach club day back at the hotel with our noodles our pizza and then just looking out to the pool with a little bit of jazz music so nice I'll see you guys tomorrow good morning good morning good morning we are up and ready for a day of exploring. We did think that we were gonna sit by the pool because I feel like yesterday was quite an intense day. I don't really know what the vlog clips look like, but I definitely wasn't very sober for them, so apologies for that. Um, 
but we had a bit of an early night actually we, we did think about going like out out again but we thought mm, probably best to just leave it so we're gonna walk down to like Mykonos town I'll try and show you a little bit more I don't think it's super windy today so I'm I'm risking hair down this could be a bad idea I don't really know but we'll see what it's like um so yeah, we're gonna do a little bit of an explore might get an iced coffee or frozen yogurt or something um, and then we, we'll probably come to the pool like a bit later in the day. We're probably doing this the wrong way around because the hottest part of the day is now. But we're going to make it work. This is my little outfit. I've gone for something very simple. So this like white linen shirt, I'll link it down below. And then just some like denim shorts. Don't really know if I'm going to get too hot in this. I'm hoping not. Um, and then Tommy's OOTD is all black. Black vest, black shorts. That's just... That's Tommy. I feel like if I was to pick a summer outfit for you, that would be it. That's it. Yeah. He's a boy that loves to wear black, I tell you. I don't think there's anything else in the wardrobe, really. Maybe something grey. There is nothing more just lovely than seeing your boyfriend just being so cute with cats. There's so many here. You're gorgeous. You're gorgeous, baby. You're lovely. I know. Is it really hot? It's actually quite cute because they have people make up these like little um, houses for them. So I can imagine there's a few cats in here. Um, there's like a little hole and they give them some water. So yeah, they're treated well here and they've got a fan. So they need to cool down. So they're not they're not living too bad. No, but it it's, like, acts as a fan though. Like it's pumping out cold air, even if that's not actually what it's for. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, I feel like that's probably where they get neutered. It's when they've got like the little chip in their ear. Your baby. We're currently at the port. I'm hoping the wind isn't too bad. I feel like the wind's okay today. Where are you going? Oh, I think he's going for a sit down. But I thought I'd show you what it looks like. The cruises dock over there. You've got Virgin Voyages and Norwegian, I think. And then along here, you've got loads of different restaurants. I think we're going to come back here this evening and maybe go to Taboo. Yeah, it's really lovely around here. It's a little bit more chilled than like the beach club vibe. I think everything's just a little bit more affordable. But it's, it's beautiful. It's a really beautiful place. Hello, hello. <laughs> hello, we are back in the room. I'm actually just sat on the floor because, oh my gosh, that was so hot. Like, it was so, so unbelievably hot as we were walking back up the hill. I was not pass out, so I'm just... Dramatic! Huh? Dramatic! It's not dramatic. That's no drama. No drama, even though Tommy's like, you were dramatic. I was not dramatic. I was so hot. Hence why I'm now sitting on the floor and eating some Cheetos. I feel like... Oh. Beeping. I feel like in the UK we obviously have Watsits which is like similar but I have to say I do think I prefer Cheetos they're a bit longer can you see so yeah this is now me and then we're gonna just chill by the hotel pool I think for the rest of the rest of the day oh my god I can't speak I think I need to have a drink um but Tommy and I have got some Prosecco to have some little pre-drinks for tonight this afternoon um and yeah, this this is literally going to be me now, just eating Cheetos, getting a tan, and I'll probably see you guys as I'm getting ready for dinner. I don't really know what I'm going to wear. I have so many outfits, and I just need to, like, decide on one. But this swimsuit is uh, naked fashion, I think. I'm kind of feeling a swimsuit vibe. I think yesterday I overindulged, and just want to have, like, a bit of a swimsuit day, and I'll go back to bikinis tomorrow. We've just set up camp in one of the little cabana things. And then this is what the pool looks like. I don't know if I've shown you guys this yet. Um, and then there's lots of other cabanas along here. It's nice. I feel quite like cozy and hidden away here. It's quite nice. Thought I would show you what the lunch looks like at the hotel. Oh my God, the wind has picked up. Sorry if that's really loud. Um, but we went for the club sandwich, which looks lovely. Okay, I know this is extremely niche, but we have this like plant thing. Oh, thank you, Tommy, with the eyes. Were you just about to pull that on my head? Yeah. All right, well, that was the end of the relationship. Anyway, right, we have this. Okay, thank you. Okay, yes, thank you, Tommy. Jesus Christ. Well, he's had one too many apples. Right, we have this 
plant. And I think it looks exactly like Beaker from the Muppets. The only Muppet here, mate, is you. All right, well, and this one here. Does it, am I going crazy? Because it's, it's giving twins. We're having a little bit of a later evening tonight. It's actually nearing eight o'clock and we've only just finished getting ready. I have got on this little naked fashion set. I can't remember when I started the vlog. I can't remember if I was wearing this in a clip, but basically I haven't worn this out yet. I was gonna wear it and then I decided not to, but because we might be going like out, out today, I thought this was a little bit more of a vibe and actually, thank God, the hotel does a shuttle bus at seven and eight o'clock. So we're gonna try and get the eight o'clock little shuttle because that walk down to town, oh my goodness, earlier, it killed me. I just, I can't do it again. I know we're probably gonna have to walk back later, but if we can only just do one way of walking, that's fine for me. Um, so yeah, that is the vibe. I'm taking the little LK Bennett bag with me again, because I feel like the purples match the purples in the outfit. And then I think we're gonna head down to the port to have dinner. There's a couple of places we like the look of. I think one of them is Taboo. But I don't know if it actually is Taboo. I don't know if the club behind is Taboo. But anyways, where Taboo is, there's a restaurant there. Or there's one called Mosaic, which I think I went to with my family like years and years ago. So we're deciding between them two. We're just going to see how we feel when we get down there. Um, I'm really fancying like a little pasta or something. Like I'm just craving carbs right now. So yeah, that is the plan. Also, I wanted to show you my little, I don't know if you'll be able to see this, my little hair clip. But the girls got me this for my birthday. And I love it, and I feel like a Pinterest girly with my Pinterest clip. We have come to Taboo for dinner, which I think is linked with a restaurant called Promenade. Um, I can't remember if I said that earlier, my brain is just not working. Look at the size of this pasta. This is my hand. How the hell am I meant to eat all of that? Then Tommy's got himself a chicken gyros, which is also huge. Then got some rosé. I know I said earlier that I was like, yeah, we're going to go out tonight. Now that we're sat down, we're, we are honestly like a couple of grandparents. We're like, mm, do we just go back and watch Netflix? That's so embarrassing, isn't it? But yeah, I am very excited to eat this. Like, the carbs have been screaming my name today. We found ourselves by like an amphitheatre watching, I don't know what kind of show to call this. Just like that, at half nine, we are back in the room. This is so embarrassing. I can't, like, no, because we were fully, well, I was fully convinced that we were gonna go out and party. Like, I had places we were on the guest list for Taboo, and no, we just, we ended up going for dinner, and then we were like, no, let's head back home. Is there any, is there anyone downstairs? Did you look? Oh, I didn't. Let's see, BRB. Okay, there's a few people downstairs, so at least some people have kind of like stayed to the hotel, but yeah, wow. We go again tomorrow. I think we're, we're just such like, um, what's the word? I was going to say early birds, but we're not that. We're, we're early night birds. We're early night owls is what we are. Once the sun goes down, we're <laughs> ready for bed. Oh my gosh, okay. Anyway, I'll see you guys in the morning. I am so tired. Like, I cannot wait to just take this makeup off and go to bed. Good morning. I thought it was about time I showed you what the breakfast looks like here. I have gone for an Eggs Benedict with bacon, which actually is pretty much like a regular Eggs Benedict. They use Greek yogurt, I think, instead of butter, which makes it a little bit lighter. Um, Tommy, I had a granola as well. Tommy's gone for one with salmon. And then this is our view. We just look out to the pool. Hello, I've realized I've barely filmed anything today, but we are heading off to Scorpios tonight. Let me move you. I feel like I can never get it perfect. But this is the outfit. We're just gonna go for drinks, I think, um, because dinner, we weren't able to get a reservation, but luckily if you're a Soho House member, you can like go in just for drinks. So thank God I have that membership. It really, pull through for me at the right time. 
But yeah, this is the outfit. The dress is super down via Revolve. It's actually quite affordable. It's like an O poly kind of price point. So not too bad. Um, bag is Strathbury. Shoes are literally the ones that I've been wearing every single day this trip. Um, my toenails are just a state at the moment. I should have re I should have done like a fresh pedicure. I kind of left it on and it's like, it's been like a week and a half now and I feel like they're chipping off. So yeah, this is the fit. I absolutely love it. Let me show you a close up as well. Like look at the sparkles. Oh my gosh, party vibes. We are here at Scorpio's. I hope the wind isn't too bad. But it's such a vibe. It's completely different to what I thought it was going to be like. So you've got like the bar area there and then this is the beach. There's loads of like sunbeds and that over there. And then you've got a DJ like over there. And then way, way, way back, you've got a whole restaurant as well. Okay, so we've somehow ended up, I think in the sunset ritual, but we didn't book a ticket for this, but we're just, we're trying our luck. Sunset's just about to happen. Gorgeous. We have found ourselves a little sunset watching spot. We're just on one of the beds here. To assume, we're assuming it's fine, um, but oh my gosh, the music and then the no, because this looks like a desktop screensaver. This is amazing, so nice. This place is such a vibe. All good, yeah. what? I had three people helping me. Three people, oh, there. Tommy had a stain on I his shirt. Like this. And this this woman, three of them here from nowhere, and they were like, oh no, red wine, oh you with the, oh and it might be lip singers, oh too many girls, and she started going like this, and I'm like, nuts. I was like, no, but you know what? It's basically yeah, look, gone. It's, I was like, yeah, my whole body's just drenched. Oh my she god. Said, oh, can you get close to the sink? Well, my head is in it, and there's three of them like that, and I was like. But you know, shout out to the Scorpios, yeah, the ladies in the girls. toilet. And I, was like, I don't know who it was. Someone got wasn't even your girlfriend, wasn't even me. I don't know what it was. Anyway, results. Yeah. You know what, thank God, because he was getting stressed about it. Well, I think it's still there. Yeah. It's only there a little bit though, it's not too bad. Anyway, beautiful things to see. How much of a vibe is this place, by the way? Look at it. I'm really enjoying the music. Yeah, the girls are girling, the girls are girling. Good morning. Today we are at Soho Farmhouse, not Soho Farmhouse, what's wrong with me? Soho Rock House. Hello, chunky boy. Yeah, you have just eaten. Um, it's absolutely stunning here. We've literally just walked in, but what a gorgeous place. That is literally, that cat is as big as my cat. How incredible is the gym area? Imagine just working out, and this is your view. What? This place is absolutely incredible. Like, it's just on another level. Just pop to the restaurant to grab some food. Look at the size of Tommy's burger. It's absolutely massive. I've just gone for the meatballs with a surprise. And then we're looking out to the pool area. We're gonna try and get a space there on one of the sunbeds later. Just got back from Soho. I actually don't know how many of the clips I filmed were usable. I filmed it all on my iPhone because they can be a bit weird with cameras there. They're weird with pictures anyway, but I was like, I'll just get some little sneaky videos. So hopefully there's a little bit of usable footage for you. But oh my gosh, what a beautiful place. It's just stunning. Like the way that they've laid it out, even like the rocks going down to like the sea. I can't remember if I filmed that because it was so windy there. Like I think today was the windiest day that we've had here by a long mile like it was so windy um but oh my goodness absolutely beautiful beautiful place with a really nice time it's about six o'clock now so we don't really know what we're going to do i don't think we're going to be dressing up and going out for dinner because i think the wind has actually like knocked it out of us a little bit i'm feeling a bit tired so i might have a nap or just a very early night so yeah what do you fancy doing do you want to go to, to the town would you not go for a, walk, go for a little walk a get our steps in a what? No, Lee Trundle. Lee Trundle. Apparently we're going for a Lee Trundle. But yeah, we need to get our steps in. We've been so solid with our steps this trip. We're getting an average of about 12, 13,000 a day. I don't think we've done many today because we literally all we did was get in a taxi and just walk around Soho. So maybe that's what we should do. What are you looking at? 
okay? Anyway, I'll keep you guys updated with what we do, but I really don't think it's gonna be very interesting. <laughs> Shout out Tommy tonight. I'm feeling a little bit poorly. I don't know what's happened. I think it's after um, the wind or I don't know, or the, or the matches. I had it so hard, I don't really know. But anyway, Tommy, bless his heart, has gone all the way into town to get us some gyros, gyros. I have got my really embarrassing little chicken and chips no salad one, which I'm sure Tommy really enjoyed ordering that. Did they say anything? No, they did look a bit funny. And he's like, so just with chips, and I was like... Yeah, chips. yeah. Also, seriously, this, this is the vibe right now. Like, how is Tommy that tanned? And I am this pale. Wait, stand here a second. I'm actually a bit red, but like, this is insane. <laughs> it's not brown, but... I used to tan so well on holiday, but I've actually gotten paler on this trip. Like, fully. How has Tommy got sunburn from today and I just have nothing? It's sunburn. It's sunburn. Well, it's, it, it all fades to tan. That's what he was saying. So, it is the next evening now. I didn't actually vlog anything today. Um, but again, just kind of like last night, there wasn't a lot going on. We just had a pool day. We both got a little bit burnt, which is not great. I don't know if you can see, like, there. A little... Ooh. Gosh, the lighting. What is happening? It's currently golden hour, but if I go into golden hour, like you literally can't see anything. Like my eyes, I just basically go blind. So, plan tonight is to head on down to town, watch our last sunset here, Moo. I know. That's really sad. Oh, wait, actually, no, we've got the one at the airport tomorrow, technically. Yeah, that's true. It's we've got one, but it's a bit different. This is sunset our last from one. From an airport's a bit different. I know. It's actually. A it's a bit depressing, kind of yeah. feels like an end, an end of an era. But we're gonna go down, enjoy it tonight. Hopefully it won't be too busy. The hotel's a little bit quieter today. So we're thinking maybe this is like an in-between day, like a Tuesday's an in-between day and won't be as busy in town. But we're gonna see, this is the dress that I'm wearing. Oh, let me, let me put you back in my spot. Okay, this is extremely dark. If I stand here, maybe you can see me. House of CB dress, actually. Let me show you, maybe you can see it a little bit better here, but it's like a gorgeous like creamy colour, maxi dress, fabulous, love it, this is my second time wearing it, and I'm very excited about it, it's really comfy. We're just watching the sunset from the port, it is super windy again, I thought I would show you it. Tonight we have come to Mosaic, which is actually a place I went to with my mum and dad a few years ago. We're looking out to the sunset. You can't really see it because I think they have these like film things to shelter from the wind because the wind is seriously windy. I think this is our windiest day so far. Mm, maybe yesterday and today. But yeah, the menu looks really nice. It looks like a nice place. I feel like you can tell someone's nice when they have like nice plates and nice cookery. So yeah, hopefully it's as good as what I remember. My cocktail is giving me Christmas vibes. It's got an orange peel and a cinnamon stick. It's too early, I know, but it's giving Christmas. Oh my God, I'm so excited for Christmas. Why am I speaking about this now? But I actually can't wait. It keeps coming from my TikTok, like Christmas videos, and I'm like, stop it, can't wait. Bloody hell, now this is quite an impressive choice from Tommy's, one for the chicken skewer. Oh, yeah. That's, you know what, that looks really good. And then I've gone for like a beef ragu, which looks absolutely delicious. Yeah, 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 all good. I'm going for me taking it down. Look at this Tommy, you don't even have to do it yourself. I was worrying that I had to do it. Yeah, I feel like you would have done a very bad job. Amazing. <laughs> Thank you. I feel like my hair is looking extra bald today. Do you think? It's really, it's like, can you hear that? It's like super crispy. Anyway, just got back to the hotel. Tonight's meal was so good, wasn't it? Really good. It was unreal. I feel like actually probably one of the nicest ones from the trip. So if you're coming to Mykonos Mosaic restaurant, definitely go there. It's like the furthest side of the port, if you put it into your maps, you'll find it. But the service was good, 
the food was amazing i've actually brought back some of my pasta with me because i just couldn't finish it like the portion was that big so yeah i would 100 percent recommend anyway i feel like because tomorrow we're leaving it's probably going to be a bit of a stressful day so i'm thinking i'm going to end the vlog here i really hope you guys enjoyed it i hope that if you're wearing headphones the wind didn't break your headphones because i am very aware that there was a lot of wind in this video, but hopefully it's not too bad. I really appreciate you watching. Thank you so, so much for staying until this point. If you have, let me know if you have any questions down below about Mykonos. I hope I've explained everything okay. But if I haven't, just let me know or message me on Insta. Thank you so much again, and I will see you in the next vlog. Bye.